Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. I want to testify to the goodness of God in my life and in this church. On Monday, as I was coming from Iyanokpaja, I alerted at Eulude bus stop. As I was going back home, someone called me. So, and I went to go and to the person again. So, on, on my way going to Olude bus stop, I, 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 I'm about to cross the one at uh, Ipaja. You know, there is war going on there. What I just had is weary. If, in fact, the bus is about to just knock my, my, uh, my enemy down. Why am I giving this testimony? If I did, didn't share this testimony this morning, I will be an ingrate. Because the first thing, if this car should eat me, number one, is either dead or long time in hospital. But I thank God. I thank God. Our God is wonderful. I tell you that too. I tell you that too. Amen. Ara kun ati pelo Olorun furo tu la sunaye won pe Oluwa ti o je kan ma ki won lo hospital leni bi awon ba ku bi ese kan ye abi ese kan orun na ba wa pe Oluwa ko fa igba ijaba oko lati gori aye won gege baba ji so bi o se meji si meta seyin bayi pe Oluwa fagile ijaba oko baba gan tu so lojo sin mi Oluwa je kini o fagile lotito se ko fagile abo fagile is the lord mo dupe fun ohun la to olorun tun se ni aye mi mo dupe nitori pe jesus tun jo mi loju bo se ma jo mi loju mo dupe pe omo mi kan o lo si ipo loyun bo tile je pe satani gbogun to to ni agbara amo olorun tun wa favor wa tori pe a pe daddy wa no luwa won tun ni ka wa won tun gbadura fa to wa ya mi lenu ko bo se gbadura yen won de fi ye wa pe bo ti won kori pomo yi ma bi mo si iya nenu olorun pelu gbogun to sele Oh my dear, we are money. Oh, just that the so go go go. Mommy, we are being money now. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Eh, Pastor, from Jesus. Amen. Our mother is thanking God for what God did in the life of a daughter that delivers safely, according to the word of the prophet through our daddy, the Lord, that He will deliver safely, and she did deliver with all problems, but no avail. Praise the Lord. Lakoko, mo dupe lowo Olorun. Pa Olorun mu me wa sinu ijo yi. Eyin eniyan ijo ti to la wa yi o. Praise the Lord. Mo dupe lowo Olorun. Fun igbe aye emi mi. Tori bi mo se n gbe tele, oto mo je osise ninu ojo. Gbogbo se ni mo nse ka ko po ninu ojo. Sugba mi mo bi pe mi ti be ni waju olorun sugbon gba ti mo debi olorun si mi loju emi o ma ma ipo ti ma wa o tu wa si mi niye bi pe lati ma le ilepa ijoba olorun mo dupe lowo lowo olorun lori awon baba wa to olorun gbe kale oluwa di mo mu o ni subu nitori pe won so olorun lo won fun mi ni opolopo mo dupe lowo olorun ekeji ni bi pe mo dupe lowo olorun ni o nti olorun se be mi ti e ka kun kekere sugbon olorun ni dada mo gbodo fi ore ohun olorun han mi ni fanu ninu le tele tele olorun pe se fanu o nlo ni kin dupe re e de pa to tu da fun jesu yi ko de da tu rara o amen a mother is something god for god did in her life firstly for transformation of life and secondly Amen. And secondly, that she did not have fun in her house. You know what that means? When there is heat, mm -hmm, everything is like that. But God uh, provided a new brand new farm for, for her. Clap for Jesus in her life. Amen. And the prayer is that it will cool her mommy not to hell in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. I want to thank God for the faithfulness of God in my life. Late last month, I was just having a dick. So I told my sister that ah, I'm having a deco because I'm not the type that falls sick. So I never knew it was an attack. On Saturday morning, on November 2nd, 
I was just seeing strange things. I was telling my sister that they want to catch me. That I'm just seeing people that they want to arrest me. My sister, she can't see anybody. That was what I knew last. I just saw myself in the hospital. The doctor told me that I was anemic. I don't have any blood in my body. I was transfused three times. The doctor said that my case is 50-50. And the doctor has even lost hope. My words were not coherent again. I was talking like, as if I have lost my senses. They also brought uh, a psychiatrist doctor. The person came. He asked, what is your name? I said, Omolayo. Where did you school? I told him. He said, this person is normal. So I, I, I never knew that I was even taken to a, an hospital before. I just woke up that day. I saw myself on a bed, hospital bed. I was asking my mom, where is this place? He said, hospital. I saw a gown on me. I said, ah, for CMC. What is this place? He said, an hospital. I was not asking her, when, when, when did you arrive? Because she is not staying in Lagos. She said it's on Tuesday. I was not asking so many questions. I never knew I, was, I, I have been unconscious for days. But God saved me. Because it was as if I have traveled for years. The doctor told me that my blood level is, I don't have any blood. So when I woke up and I was conscious, I was just say, say, telling the doctor that I'm okay, I want to go home. The doctor now called me that your blood level is seven and the normal level should be eleven. I, said, I want to go home because I saw so many things, so many revelations. I want to go home. So, okay, they now had a board meeting, okay, that they will let me go home. But my mind, I will, I will be having this fear as if I want to die. I will be telling my sister, I'm having this fear. I will just be begging people, Emasha Abinu. I never knew that the plan of the enemy was to make me mad. But the Lord, in his mercy, revived me. My sister told him that my leg and my hand were green. I was tiny because I didn't eat for weeks. I was on drip and injection. But the God of this mountain is so faithful. He revived me. I was an hopeless case. I never even knew what God has done for me. But I was told to come for medical checkup last two weeks Monday. When I went to the hospital, I did not even leave the bed throughout my stay in the hospital. I was not looking at months of going, I'm a shaman woman by only go to my old dumb bunny. How just people will just come. Are you not Amalaya? I said yes. When you not the one that was admitted last week, I said yes. People were doctors, cleaners, everybody was just thanking God on my behalf. I want to thank God for his mercy on my life. And I want to thank God for daddy, my daddy in the Lord, Daddy Omolewa, and all the pastors and all the church members. God revived me. God make me a living soul. Praise the Lord. Hey, the pato to da funji sui. Hey, the pada da. Amen. Arabi wa di kwa la lor nukwe uluwa re mi awa pada. Otomo. Money you pay one life for the cake. I for you know, you are too low. Lati a for you, oh dear, I sang gang gang gang. Lati I sang gang gang gang. Oh, the people led the ladder. She won't loan you. Allah, I will quit your second you. Oh dear, Allah, you fool. Touch your social now. You want your job, but I'll put you. Amen. I don't call to you and let you pay at the docket out at a bile hospital. But one second you want to do well. Fuji. Lower Jesu Lorikino, Loria Yen won't do Pelo Jesu Loria Yen, you know. Praise the Lord. I mark for Wayek. So the center where I mark, they did not invite me. So I decided to go and what we call gate crash in another center. When I got there, one, two people did not come. But Satan wanted to remove me. Before I came, about three of them connived that they would take that person's envelope home to the person, which is not usual. That is not the order of Wayek. If you did not coordinate, you will not mark. But I coordinated. The person that did not coordinate, they wanted to take his envelope home to him, and he was not there. He even told them that he was not coming, that he lives. Eh? That's what I want, if I did not. So he sat on the envelope. One of them sat on the envelope, and then uh, there was an escape, so everybody ran out. By the time we came back, the chief examiner now asked for the envelope. Where is so-so-so and so person's envelope? She sat up, and they gave me her envelope. Praise the Lord. Amen. 
Ara bi ra so pe awon ma a awon ton o ma n a maki exam fun awon a olusi don wo wa ye kini sugbon lodun yi won gba on kro ni oju la sugbon lo se kini o gba on pada ngba to lohun tun gba on pada won ti joko le kini o o wa yo won loruko jesus en to joko lo wa yo reyin na run yo si dide won wa wi pe oludari agba se kini o o wa da si o wa di pe awon tun won ru won le mark won se kini o won mark loruko jesus ire ti o kan lodun yi yo to si o ejo e ba mi ke jesus ti le meta ki se ori e du ajo e je mo binu sa ta ra wa la ke en e a dide duro jesus ti le meta hallelujah le meta a dide duro amen 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 so am i after the testimony we shout it together odun meta lori oke of tie o me de yi bolobolo lati ori oke en de isale o me kan ko le soro mo gbogbo awon eyan won ni hospital straight mo ni no a gbe lo hospital mo kan gbe o me pada soke mo gbe o me mora bo gbogbo ara e mo ni kan lo fun mi lo mi gbogbo mi si lara ngba ti o ma to be 30 minutes o me kan bere sin se re ni mo aso kun yawo mi mo ni yawo mi mo ni ko ma wa ti program mi o ni force e lati ma wa o be ti wo lo a ma wa mo pe a lot of testimonies in in, in this church so e ba mi ke jesus che le meta hallelujah amen let me am a ke pakko ta ba se ton god bless so omo e o nche reason fine fine o nje on po je normally ko ni problem kan praise the lord hallelujah amen e pa te fun jesus na ye won o de pa bo se pa nti e na ndara amen our dad is appreciating God for what God did. He's so happy. That's why I want us to share three. Uh, thank you, Jesus, and Hallelujah. A three-year-old boy fell from an upstairs, and after he was picked up, he couldn't talk. But the, our father took him up and put water on him. And I know you had prayer water. And he told the wife, "I've we asked you to come for prayer." After 30 minutes, the boy what became revived and started what playing till today. For what God have done in the life of that boy. Clap for Jesus Christ, please. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. I thank God for what God has done in my life. I've been praying for something, I call it something big, for just four years. But this month of, month of prosperity, God has done it for me. Praise the Lord. The second day, the second day something happened to me. Something strange happened to me last Friday. In fact, I don't know whether it's attack, it belongs to God. So, in the night, I just find myself. I start stooling and vomiting, stooling and vomiting. Ah, I don't know. Before I see, I don't have my, I lost my strength. So I manage myself. In the morning, I want to wake again. I see that no strength in me. So I have my Omi by my side, my Bible by my side. And I start asking for mercy. I rub all the Omi on the bed, on my body, everywhere. And I God opened my eyes to go to uh, Psalm 51. So at the end of rubbing the omiye on my body and read this, I just stood up again. I said, ah, it was wonderful. I don't know because what happened to me, I've not experienced it in my life. I lost my strength. I don't know what to do. So, but God has restored me. This omiye is a very wonderful water. Amen. And I thank God for that. Eh de pato to da yi o. Amen. Ara ku bi wa tu ko Olorun pe bi ojo mi lo seyin awon be si ni yagba won bi. De bi pe ko soku mo ninu awon. Sugbon Olorun ran Olorun lati le kabibeli ati lati kini o lati mu omiye. Lei ton mu ton lai je un lai logun. Oku se kini o o de alokun atagbara satani o ni gba lowo re. Amen. Praise the Lord. Mo du pe lodo Olorun alaye. Ngba ta se service ton mi ni jo Sunday. Mo bo si waju lati ra omi mo ti en wo ko si senji won ba mi wa ba mi wa ah mommy eh eh mu wa fun wa so ma mu wa leni mo ko so yen ni ngba to de ma di monday bayi mo ko wa nu faranda wa nbe mo ngba tegun bi ori mi se jide ni yen ti gbogbo awon kokoro ai ni ai ri mi ori won o mo de se nta o ta mi ni yen ton later bayi ti ma dide bayi o da npe kon da ye pe si yan loju ki ki gbogbo mi fe seju bayi ki gbogbo ah mba ni aya yo pa awon alejo wa fi ibero ati ojo jade ko ni bi kon na fi won gbogbo awon alejo to wonu agba ara mi bayi kon ma jade ma gbe omi alai ba la ju si oju orun mo ba ndam jesu o se jesu o se jesu o se mo dupe lodo olohun ngba tu mo su ma wonu lesson 
mo tun be si ri mo tun wa gbe omo ni ore lama na se fun ke lo mi alaye yi o bi mo se gbe ni en babere si da sori gbogbo ri busun mi gbogbo bed mo da si o wetin mo ri orun yesi ma to tun di tuesday mo tun fe ri fere fe lati wednesday mi gburu e mo mo dupe lodo olorun alaye olorun ti o je fo loju ti o je tori mi daru mo dupe mo yin olorun logo amen our mother is absolutely God for what did in her life on Sunday, she was just there was no change to buy water, but he was given privilege to take it home. On knowing that there is a miracle God wants to use the water for, he felt stings on her body, even from her eyes, as if to be get blind through unseen incense. But to God be the glory, he used the prayer water both on Monday and Tuesday. Here she is with her eyes open and could see very well, and she's what heart and what healthy. Yeah. Praise the Lord. Travel, <laughs> Bo sha dupe pe a lo se nowo yen a lo layo abo layo gbogbo ipinu satani olorun so di asan ke ba mi yin oluwa logo elekeji ni wi pe mo tin bere kan lowo olorun ti pe olorun de ti se fun mi e ba mi praise the lord o amen e pa to fun jesus na mama wa o amen ah uh, our mother is appreciating god for what god did for save our journey to us through and through for an engagement in the learning, even though she, they, they had dreams about evil things happening on the way, but to God the glory, none of them came to what to pass. And secondly, what she has been asking God for so long, God what God answer her. I say speedily, God will answer you today. Praise the Lord. I thank God for my life and the life of my family. I give God all the glory. I bless the name of the Lord. About three weeks ago, our father in the Lord mentioned a word of uh, prophecy. He said there is, uh, there is a family on their way that God is about to bless them. And uh, after that, he said they are around. So when I got to my, my mother and my sister, they told me that, ah, can you imagine that what God did in their life today, that when they were about to step into the auditorium that the Bible mentioned their case, I said, ah, praise God. So the next day, my sister had been looking for a job. So they called her where they, she dropped her CV. They said that she should come around 2 o'clock. So, ah, it's too late now that she can't come, that she is leaving very fast. He said, no, you, we need you now, come. He said, what about on Saturday or Monday? He said, no, just now. She said, she's not well dressed. He said, just come anywhere you are. So when she got there, it was as VI. When she got there, she met two people there. They were being interviewed. So she interviewed that, and they said, okay, you can go. So on her way, when she was coming, they called her, are you, are you at home? She said, no. They then said, okay, when you get home, we'll call you back. So the next day, they called her. They said, you should come on Monday to resume the work. So she was the only one that was choosing. So I bless the name of the Lord. I give him all the glory. Yesterday, praise the Lord. Second, the secondly, so yesterday, my sister, my younger sister, my mother asked her, and I, I not to go out, but she, uh, she insisted and she went out. She never informed any one of us. So we thank God that she uh, God saved her from accident. We bless the name of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Amen. Arabra, the color of the Lord, and I will son, you know, but you will be a young one, and Leno, once you buffoon, Dilian. You put it all, Arabia, and Totu, watch a phone, Jotu, to pay, but you can do Ulua, she say, Yano, for pay, come Murabova, she walk, but you go, go to fish, you know, Tovisha, we pay more, she buy 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 more, one mama ni pe ko ma jade ni le pe ko duro sinu le o fa gidi jade sugbo olorun se kini o o gba lowo ijamba oko mo loruko jesus lodi o ni show for 